Yo, what's good, everybody? Welcome to the INE of Gaming. And yeah, we're starting ZZZ again. Third episode. Um, yeah, let's start it. Whether it's yourself or the world. That was a nice way of pausing it. Whether it's yourself or the world. Then it just stops. <laughs> hey, look at those kicks. That'd be cool if they gave us like some cosmetics. <sighs> This game takes a while to load, doesn't it? It's probably because it's, I guess, like, you know, there's so much stuff in the city. But then again, probably just means that I probably have to uh, upgrade. Upgrade the PC again. It's about that time anyway. Oh, what's this? So it's everything loading okay and all right looks like it is all right so we had to so the last episode we had to um pretty much ran into like a neko type character and she was asking us for help so basically our team pretty much is had to go retrieve something for her and ended up in a like a blast site or something like that and basically we have to pretty much get them out of there or else they're going to be cooked. And we don't want that to happen. So yeah, let's do it. I got anything in the mail? Nope. <laughs> Life insurance. <laughs> eh, I'll do it later. I right, saw so the explosive last train. Okay, so we gotta get them out of there before it's too late. Oh, trial mode. Okay. You use your own agents. Oh, okay. That's cool. Oh, she's going by herself. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, I'm liking this track. Hello, Wise. Nekomada, can you hear me? Loud and clear. Oh, this is cool. I've never seen a proxy who's able to communicate in a hollow. No wonder Nicole says you're the best in Nuiridu! Always glad to hear that. It's time to put the plan into action and stop the train. Before that, let's go over each step. No problem. I've got it down pat. Our target is Vision's train carrying the explosives. Since it's controlled by a computer in the driverless mode, we can put obstacles in certain sections to change the train's route and force it through a tunnel. Then, while the train's slowing down to go through the tunnel, I'll find a way to throw your Bing Boo on top of the train!
The plan is to make the train car break down, right? That's right. Wise, your task is to enter the train through the vent on the roof and head to the driver's compartment to shut the train down. Don't worry, Barry and I will assist you throughout the process. As for the dead-end butcher, unfortunately, we still can't pinpoint its location. Be careful out there. Roger that! Good luck, guys. Let's get started. Sinking info for route to the control room. Please enter here. Great! Let's hurry up and switch the tracks now! Uh-oh. Hello, ether activity is changing. Be careful. Hopefully this mutation also delays the train a little. Wait, why do I feel like it's coming from nearby? Warning, high-risk unit detected. Please stay away. Uh... Infamous ethereal. What an intense aura. We are near the control room. I can override the controls for the track so you can alter its direction. Hmm. Yeah, let's go for it. The train will pass through this area coming from the marker. There is a decelerator device in this area. Use it to slow down the train for a chance to board. Got it. Changing tracks now. Is this like timed or? Uh oh. Reminder you can use heavy objects to weigh down the mechanism. Yeah, that sound. Is the dead end butcher back? No, the train's coming. large obstacle up ahead. The original plan to stop the train requires us to pass through this obstacle. You are small, and the client is essentially a cat. Perhaps you can squeeze through. Yeah, it's worth a try. doing here a proxy are we going the right way nekomata there's no problem with your route judging from how the train was damaged by external forces it's very likely an ethereal threw it here <laughs> oh that's some scary strength your next stop is on the other side of the train car do you think you can get across if it were just me i could probably get across but not with the bang boo and with all these sinkholes around, I don't think we could just walk around the train. Uh, um, excuse me? Yeah? Who's speaking? Is that the train car? And with a gorgeous lady voice? <laughs> <laughs> excuse me, Miss Train. We're in a rush here. Could you please scoot aside and let us wiggle past? 
<laughs> Please, Miss Train. <laughs> Stop playing around, Nekomata. Someone's on the other side. I get it. It's nice to liven the mood a bit when we're stressed. But don't scare the lady over there. Excuse me? Are you investigators from the Hollow Investigative Association? Uh oh. Uh. -oh. What's up? Can we help you with something? Hang on a sec. Whether we're with the association or not, shouldn't we find out who Miss Train is first? In this line of work, people usually introduce themselves. Huh? Is that right? Sorry, I didn't know the protocol. Um, my name's Corin. I work for a housekeeping company. I'm at Gemini. RH negative blood type. I like cleaning. My social security <laughs> number is... Bro, what? Uh, you don't have to cover all the details. Anyway, how come you're in a place like she this? She's really about to give the social security. There's a very dangerous ethereal nearby. I got separated from my companions while hiding from it. I don't have any carrot data with me. If you're investigators, then you'll know the way out of here, right? Could you please lead me out? So, she's just an ordinary person lost in the hollow. Mm. But what the heck's a lost maid doing somewhere so dangerous? What do you think? Should we help her? Not unless we can somehow break through the train car to the other side. Otherwise, to stay on time for our plan, we've got to turn back immediately and choose another route. Excuse me! Sorry, I was listening to your conversation. Are you saying if I can get you to the other side, I can come with you? Yeah? You can get us through? Uh, almost. Hang on. I'm nearly there. You want to go underneath? Watch out! Are you hurt? Phew! Good, my apron's okay. Huh? Uh, nice to meet you, investigators. I saw through it. Hey, it's the character that we already have. Nice to meet you, investigators. I saw through. Oh, it was this Bangboo talking to me just now. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, I didn't mean to question your identity as a Bangboo. You can think of me as a Bangboo if you want, but in any case, you don't seem like an average person. Sorry. Uh... Well, we work in many different fields, including the hollow services. Oh, right. You're in a hurry, aren't you? I can help. As long as you take me out of this hollow. Uh, please. What do you think? Now that she's helped us destroy the train car, we can move forward on our original route, right? Hmm. She's not asking much. Yeah, I agree with Wise. There's nothing wrong with taking her to one of the Hollow's exits. But she's a stranger. She may be hiding things. Miss Coin, we'll let you come. Just be sure to stay quiet along the way, okay? Okay. Good, let's press on then. <laughs> What's with that face? <laughs> Corrin, we need your help for this fight. I have to fight. Well, I got the agreement you had to talk so much. He didn't mean it to be completely silent. Really? He misunderstood. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
move something heavy. The goal is to use it to weigh down the switch. Huh? You mean those stones up ahead? Uh, okay. Sufficient gear coins paid. Authentication successful. Opening valve. Nah, we'll just collect it. Huh. The train seems to be going the wrong way today. Chainsaw slinging maid? Oh, wowzers! The sound of the equipment, too, is nice. Move it right here! is complete. Great. Let's drop off Corin on the way out. Warning. Hollow exit detected within 100 meters. The commission for the housekeeping company employee, Corin, could be completed. Huh? Faithin? Did you say something? It's nothing. I was just saying that our guest reached her destination. Huh? Really? You found an exit? Great. Uh, th th thank you so very much. Oh, 
Without your help, <clears throat> I'd be lost in this hollow forever. You did pretty good yourself. Thanks to your chainsaw, we really cut a lot of time there. It's my first time meeting a real-life Bingboo Hollow investigator. Can you p please tell me your names? Uh, I'll come back with my companions to thank you later. Hmm... Yeah, sure. Stopping by to say thanks sounds great. I'll be looking forward to it. Yeah? You for real? Wouldn't that expose your identity? Oh, I get it. After being so defensive with me, it's no problem if it's Corrin. <laughs> uh, my apologies for speaking out of turn. It appears that would be inconvenient. I think I should be leaving now. Now, all we have to do is wait for the train to arrive. The train's slowing down! Wait, this isn't the regular route! Everyone, on alert! Now's our chance! Let's jump! Easy. Master, the train is about to enter the tunnel. Please make sure that you and your client are ready. Go, Proxy! Careful, Master. Your posterior struck the train roof with considerable force. <sighs> this body's even more clumsy than I thought. <sighs> Just look at these short arms. Don't be discouraged. Your sibling liked your appearance. I believe... Tiny and cute was how they described you. My apologies for not being cute enough normally. <laughs> this window is small even for Nekomata, and she's basically a liquid. But it's a piece of cake for you. You should be called King of the World. Now, King of the World, please head to the driver's compartment to complete your coronation. Okay, okay. Just need to press the emergency stop button. This mission is such a pain, having a dress like this. Suck it up. My shoes don't fit either. Hey, Captain said we've deviated from the route. What's going on? Huh? Uh-oh. <sighs> Looks like this train was loaded with a lot more than just explosives. The news didn't mention any of this. Come in, Captain! A talking bamboo just fell in from on top of the train. Should we hand it over to Director Perlman? Yes, sir. Eliminate immediately! <laughs> What's going on here? Oh, wait! Oh! No. Over here! You should head back! Leave this to me! I've got a carrot! See you later at the store! Guys, can you hear me? What just happened? Something's off. I'll tell you when I get back to the store. Interesting. Du, du, du. Oh, hey, you're back. Why don't you go get some rest? I'll go check on Eos. Hmm, let's see. What's the news about Nekomata? Any news from Nekomata? I haven't been able to get a hold of her. She should still be in the hollow. She said she had a carrot, but the exit is probably pretty far. But it's not all bad. The news just said Vision is putting off the demolition on Canvas Street until at least tomorrow night, due to technical difficulties. Due to technical difficulties. So, Vision is planning on covering everything up. Right. Vision must have already realized the train deviated from its original route, but they hid it from the media. 
What's more, Vision clearly said it was an unmanned train with explosives, but it was full of armed soldiers. They were dressed like public security, but I heard them saying, this mission is such a pain having to dress like this, and my <laughs> shoes don't fit either. There's no way they were real. Yeah, and I've got this feeling that Neko Mod has been hiding something from us too. We should oh, yeah, ask her definitely. when she gets back. But let's not think about that for now. You should get some rest before she gets here. Sinking with the Bang Boo can be very draining after all. I could rest or I could go to the arcade. Oh, but you know what? Then again, I probably should. What's this? Oh, it must be like a new, um, <sighs> it must be uh, like one of those new, um, things, uh, refills. Oh, we do have a few of these, though. Yeah, let's get some more materials. Probably get more weird dreams. Interesting art. Tin Master. Oh, the shop must be open. So what just happened? And it's giving me a headache. What's up? from the start. <clears throat> Let's 
they're a most wanted criminal? <laughs> Are the commercial spies messing with you? that drinking coffee before playing a VR game improves your skills? You think so? Hmm. Sounds like a good thing to me. Yeah, sure. So long as I get paid. So this must be like another set of buffs that we could get. I'm thinking. So if we don't have like the materials I'm guessing like for food and such then that's probably what's gonna be it here is you know making coffee instead from the shop. Hey, to mess up here. No rush. Oh, imagine if there's like a mini game to this. Let's see what happens. Easy. Eh, it'll be a piece of cake. Don't worry about it. Leave it to me. Oh, <laughs> I guess not. Everything is changing before my very eyes now that I'm drinking my coffee. What? <laughs> mm -hmm. I highly recommend you try it out. The results are immediate and evident. Yeah, I don't think coffee messes with your vision, man. You sure you're not adding any other substances in there? Tin Master Special. High score, here I come. Bro, you gonna drink all that coffee 
and still not get that high score. And then you're going to try and blame it on the coffee, saying that you're too hyper and jitt jittery. <laughs> I don't want to hear it. <laughs> so scientific indeed. So about the flavor? What? Hello. Have you delivered all the coffee? I really appreciate your help. You know it. I've had my fair share of real world experience too. You could just pay the HIA a visit, right? Okay, so proxies can purchase one beverage daily, which will be used to recharge a battery charge and grants a buff. Oh, better, efficient, better efficiency in obtaining certain materials. Have a cup of coffee to jumpstart your day. intelligent machine, but I still grind my coffee beans by hand. It's huh, a nice looking coffee. Black tea latte. Black, wait, black tea latte? Huh. No machine ground beans here. Well, whenever you feel lost, you can always come back here for a cup of coffee. Hmm. What if I'm lost on my way to even looking for the, the coffee shop? What if I get lost on my way there? Then what? Now I'm lost and got no coffee. Hey, parking lot. Nice, we're gonna be get, getting a bunch of stuff and uh 
I think we could get a few more of... Oops. Didn't mean to do that. Like we don't have enough yet to do a free temple. Oh yeah, I forgot about this. Okay, so we're at the starting chapter two, and then we get this free unit. Nice. <coughs> All right, so we got. I guess I gotta work towards that. It's this one. That's pretty hot. What's this one? Oh, this is the chapter three story. Okay. That was like a login thing. Oh, is this the uh, the like the fast travel type thing? Oh, nice, and we're driving. Very fancy. I have it. It's great. Seem to be far more interested than I thought. Slogan? Yeah, let's participate in the trials. Oh, 
Oh, nice. Okay, so it provides rewards. Would you like to use the VR device right now? Yeah, let's do it. Let's see what this is all about. Oh, okay. So this is like... It does have some of the rewards of like leveling up um, the units and whatnot. <laughs> I definitely need these. So the more identical ones there is, the more difficult things will be. All right. Oh, wait, what? what are you doing? Let's do that. I want to fight all of them. Oh, save the plan. Okay. Standing by. Time for some hard labor. Come on, let's get to work. It's our turn, bro. Ready for combat. I have. How can I help? All right. So we got the time for some hard work. Come on, let's get to work. <clears throat> Need something? My services are expensive. Good choice. Standing by. Nothing. <gasps> It's our turn. Starlight, it's... If you need help, call me anytime. Come on, let's get to work. Construction, start. <gasps> need standing by. Mm. I have two guns, so double the accuracy. Yeah, well, you I'm ready to roll. Get away from me! Right back at ya! Whoa, what is this?
Okay. Leave it to Billy. Hey, now. Move on or back to the real world. I got ya. I could have sworn I said it to like three of them though, right? It was only two. Ah, right, let's try it again. Bad. 
Is the increased score significant? <laughs> Wait, hold on. If by chance you're also interested in hollow investigation work, this is an expression of interest. Thanks, but no thanks. I'm good. Standing by. Hmm, okay. Let's go. Alright, so we can finally start promo uh, what is it? Promoting our units now so we can go further. Uh oh. Wait, who's that? Interesting. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Get one master tape for that. Nice. Wait, I wonder though, is that for like each one? Oh, it is. Oh, that's cool. And then we get free. Um, we get one free pull, I think. Right. Let's see. Who else can we level? Oh, yeah. We, you know, we definitely got to get Billy up there. Wait, what is Billy? Oh, he's attack. Okay. Yeah, let's give him that. There's something wrong with the rewards. Nope, there's no problem. Wait, can I exchange it if there's something wrong? <laughs> Just kidding. I don't know anything about this. <laughs> Did 
She's like, okay, weirdo. <laughs> Free device. Oh, nice. But why 1024? She said it was a whole number. Whew. I am yawning a lot. Oh man. Oh, it's probably because it's really hot in here. Hold on. I'll be right back. <laughs> That's much better. The thrill of combat as a hollow investigator. Got it. I'll come back again. Start collecting all of that. Ready for combat. What's this? Are these like another form of, of dailies? Might be. Oh, yeah, yeah, this is like a season pass type thing. Okay. Okay, so we got like six of these. <clears throat> oh, so we need six of these in order to get the 50 50. Oh wait, we could do uh I think we could do a ten pull right now. Hold on, let's do it. Can we? Oh no we can't. You gotta consume six forty, okay. So we need uh need a few more. That's okay.
Oh, nice. We can start fast traveling now. bad vehicle I mean it's a little boxy but it's got some pretty cool designs on it nice accessories and whatnot within five seconds of the device being connected to the household power source. God damn, that is fast. Forget we're trying to lay low, fairy. And give up what I'm what could be a way to earn the rewards. What? Will to accept with the I the HIA's rules and give up on Whoa 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 whoa. Let's take it easy now, fairy. I didn't say all that. slightly farther away from the HDD. I've noted it down. stuff I'm trying to find if there's like some more rewards or doesn't look like it.
strange. I could have sworn I was able to convert them. <sighs> Whoa, wait, what was that? Oh, there we go. Sure, we get like five of those. And for this one, we gotta get like, I think like six, right? Oh, nice. There it is. Boom, 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 boom. I do three. All right. I think we have enough. All right. Let's try for the temple. Hold on. Before we even do that. Let's just go here. <clears throat> Supposed to get like the fifty, right? Fifty fifty. again. Oh, nice. We got another Billy. Okay, we got another B. And one more. There we go. Oh, the music changes too when you get an SSR. Nice. What we get? Hey! My turn to shine. Exactly who I wanted to get. <laughs> nice. Alright, so we got 13, right? Alright, let's see what happens. Let's get a temple. Oof. Oh, it's like we didn't get anything. Oh, look, we got another copy. All right, so it looks like we got to get seven more of these. Ready for combat. Nothing to- Come on! I'll help. 
It's it. Need some starlight. It's time to shine. It's time to shine. All right. Let's go. I have two guns. Oh, good. Come on. Did you? A minute. <gasps> if you need help, call me anytime. A mission? Take me along. <laughs> it's out. Nothing to fear. Come on. I'll help you win. The lunch is on you. Bring her at level twenty. Oh. Wait, is she um an attacker? Yep. Oh, that's a support one. We could give that to um what's her name? Boom the cannon. Nothing to fear. The cunning hairs are here. Get another one right here. Nice. Get two more here. Alright, so we got six now, so now we got we need like four more. Alright, let's do the story. You guys did, right? <laughs> nah, not really. We've got some questions for you.
But then the stupid train got away, so Nicole and the others are still in danger. Well, what should we do now? We need to figure out a plan of action quickly. Don't worry. I understand how you feel, Nekomada. But first, we need to have a little chat. Uh, what's going on? Why the sudden change in tone? The hair on my ears is standing up. Nekomada, this is important, so we want you to be honest. What kind of trouble did you and the cunning hairs get yourselves into exactly? Didn't the news say the train was transporting explosives? Why would it be carrying a bunch of fake PubSec officers? And you reacted so quickly to the enemy. Not like something you'd expect from someone in shock. It's time to come clean. Time to come clean, Neko. You gotta tell us what's going on. Be straight with us. Are you trying to set us up? Well, well about that. If you want support from Faithin, you better answer my brother and tell us what you're hiding. I'm not trying to hide anything from you guys. I really didn't know there were people on that train. It's just that I've seen guys dressed like that somewhere else. You're totally right. The Cunning Harris and I are in big trouble this time. But we just wanted to save people. Rescue. To save people? Are you saying that you and Nicole are going on a rescue mission? That's because... It's so ridiculous! I didn't even think I could explain it! We were so busy trying to stop the train earlier! You didn't have time to finish watching the Bang Boo's visual record! But Nicole's Bang Boo actually captured everything on camera! You'll understand when you finish watching it! Why didn't you tell us to do that... earlier? <coughs> So that's the fairy. to get used to the ether concentration here. I wasn't feeling too good when we first got in. Hey, we might not have come across any strong ethereals yet, but the dead-end butcher is around here somewhere, so stay on your toes. Especially Billy. You totally got carried away in that last battle. How many times have I told you not to make a ruckus? We need to get to the Red Fang Gang's base and finish this commission. Can't you be more like Nekomara? Fast and quiet? Even if the dead end butcher did come along, it might not even notice her at all. <laughs> What's I gotta say? We can't be blood nine lives. That counts for something. Everyone wait. You see the railroad tracks on the side of the road? It's not just broken off here. A gaping hole has been clawed out. Oh, she's right! Looks like the dead end butcher has been here. We might come across it if we keep going. That's no good. Since there's signs of it here, let's find another way around. Nekomara, will you see if your carrot can suggest another way to the Red Fang Gang's base? Yeah, I can find another route. But the path we're on is the most direct. I know you're anxious to find your family heirloom, but this is no normal mission. Safety first, as they say. You sound like someone stepped on your tail. Over there! I saw a little kid run past just now! Huh? What are you talking about? You know we're in the Dead End Hollow, right? There have been cases of small children entering the hollows by mistake. 
But the direction you're pointing, Nekomata, is the original route we were planning on taking. Hey! You think I'm just saying it to make you take that path? I really did see a kid! A little girl in a blue top with brown hair and a ponytail! Hmm, that's a pretty detailed description. Maybe she really did see her. Even if we believe you saw the child, are you suggesting we go save her first? I should remind you, this is not what we were commissioned to do. Gotta pay extra. What's that supposed to mean? It's not part of the commission, so you'll just ignore a child lost in the hollow? <laughs> I knew you were boring, but cold-blooded too? If you're worried about not getting paid, don't be. I'm not like you. I'll pay you extra for looking for the girl. There you go. Hmm. I didn't expect you to not be a bad person. Oh, uh, huh? Oh, that had me scared just now. When she pointed out the child, I really thought her next line was gonna be, Forget the kid! I want my family heirloom! <laughs> <laughs> but this kitty's a kind employer. If you really are determined to save the girl, Nekomata, then I'll go with you. You don't need to use the commission fee as a bargaining chip. And B, you should at least ask me when it comes to commission fees. Yep. <sighs> Guess it can't be helped. But I agree, we can't just leave a kid in a place like this. A Thanks, kid's aptitude for ether is underdeveloped, we're, and she we're, can't we're save doing herself. a second objective. Every free minute spent now. in the hollow is dangerous. <laughs> not to mention the dead end workers around it is. here somewhere. Then <laughs> let's get going. Time and space change fast in the hollows. If we don't hurry, we'll never find her. What are you waiting for, Nekomata? Let's go. Uh, oh, coming. They really seem to be sincere. Uh, oh, man. Why am I thinking about this now? So many ethereals around. It really worries me. Luckily, I didn't see any signs of them on the way over. Still, hopefully we can find her and fast. Nice one, Billy. are pretty good too hey do you all think there are more and more claw marks around here we've been coming across stronger ethereals too now that you mention it we can't keep going like this how can we save anyone when we're in danger ourselves we need a plan Nekomata, are you sure you saw her why is it every time you see her we find nothing the hollow changes so quickly. By the time we've gone over, things have already warped. It's not my fault. If we want to catch her, you guys just need to keep up. Negative. Bruh. 
We don't have the physical advantages when it comes to running like you do. In our current situation, we should reserve our energy to escape if we encounter the Dead End Butcher. Oh. What's that supposed to mean? You talk about saving people, but when the time comes, you can only think of yourselves. That's not true. Really? Then you mean you aren't confident in your abilities? I can't pretend I didn't hear that. If I get serious, even Billy using his fuel reserves can't beat me. <laughs> I can't pretend I didn't hear that, Andy. <laughs> no problem, then. We'll just run after the girl for Why now. Why you gotta bring Billy into this? I'm more than happy to. <laughs> well, wait. Isn't anyone gonna ask my opinion? They just left her right out. Is very captivating. It's really uh, interesting. From the looks of it, we're already deep within the dead end hollow. I pooped. We've been riding for so long. You guys have pretty good stamina. Weren't you the one who said the only way to catch up with the kid was to run? Now you're the first to complain. Nonsense! I can still outrun you all. Okay, okay. Everyone just take a break. We'll keep looking in a minute. On second thought, this area is about to be demolished, so the residents should have been evacuated. How did a kid get in? Uh, well, maybe she got lost when her family was being evacuated. Are you lying? If it's like that movie, only a ghost would appear in such a place. I get the feeling she's her lying. Her sudden appearance was only to lead the rescuers into a deadly trap. There's no such thing as g g ghosts <laughs> And don't do movie promos at a time like this Don't worry, if a ghost attacks, I'll protect everyone Really, can you guys not and say stuff exactly like that? And how exactly are you going to do that? Right, I feel better now Let's get going huh? Wait a sec It's a kid, over there Don't run Oh Play wait for us. So they were real Huh? Wait, that can't be right. There really is a kid. Look, see, she was home. lying from the start. <laughs> oh man, she's a trick. We gotta keep moving. She originally was lying. <laughs> Let's win, Jimmy! 
It's okay. Everything's fine. It must be scary being lost in a hollow all by yourself, right? Don't worry. I'm here now. <laughs> what are you talking about? Huh? <laughs> uh, uh, we saved you. So much of being a hero. Uh, saved me? <laughs> I saved you! Why are you wandering around that monster's territory? If I hadn't led you here, you'd have walked right into it. Huh? What do you mean? If it weren't for you guys, I might have found the Hollow's exit back to New Eridu by now. I think I can hear something. Uh-oh. What's going on? Uh, an ethereal? Th that's the dead end butcher? Oh boy. He's a lot bigger than I expected. <laughs> it's catching up. We've got nowhere left to run. Huh? This bright light! Ah! Uh, it's the hollow exit! She fell outside! Ah! Ah! A pretty risky, but cool landing. <laughs> I almost got a concussion. I didn't expect to get out of the hollow like this. Nicole. Uh, seriously, why is every single commission such a struggle? Nicole. Nekomata, <laughs> considering the circumstances, don't you think we deserve a bonus? Nicole. I hear you. I've barely been sitting on you for a minute. Stop complaining. No, it's not that. Look in front of you. Huh? Oh. Isn't this oh, Canvas no. Street? Then these people are... Wait. This is the Blast Zone. It was supposed to be cleared. Why are there so many people? Oh, that's not good. How many are there? Over a hundred at least. Me and Envy only did a rough count of whoever was willing to come out and speak to us. There could be even more. I thought that Vision said they cleared everyone out days ago. They say they don't know what's going on. They haven't been able to contact anyone on the outside for a week. I'm guessing Vision has set up jamming devices. Yeah, so what is this? When exactly is Vision planning to evacuate everyone? Children, you must be coming from the city. Are you bringing any news? Excuse me, who are you? Oh, the little girl you just saved from the hollow is my granddaughter. Thank you for rescuing her. She's always been naughty. She thinks she can sneak into the hollow safely just because she's got ether aptitude. Yesterday, because a public security officer wouldn't tell her the exact time, she came up with an idea to go to New Eridu and ask around. I took my eyes off of her for one second and she ran into the hollow. Um, excuse me, an officer? Did you say an officer came by? Yes, that's right. Yesterday my granddaughter and a few neighbors got tired of waiting and headed to ask Vision what was going on. But an officer stopped them before they got there. They said nobody could get through because explosives were being handled nearby. And once things were ready, a train would be coming for us. Most of us here are old, sick, and disabled. Other than my granddaughter, none of us have any aptitude for ether. So we can't go anywhere. We were told to wait. So that's oh, all that's we can foul. do. But it doesn't make sense. 
How can something as big as a mass evacuation of residents not be scheduled in advance? They just left everyone waiting for notice. And I haven't heard of public security being involved in the project before. Miss, you mean to say... That public security officer who stopped the residents is suspicious. Huh. There has to be more to it than this. I remember them saying Vision Corporation won the bid thanks to a much lower cost. I get it. The Metro Renovation Project is one of the most talked about in New Era Do. It's technically and financially demanding, and they still have to relocate the residents. But if Vision just dealt with the residents along with the demolition, that it save costs. So, what you're saying is, Vision has just abandoned us all here? Pretty much. Vision always wanted to perform well enough to enter tops, <clears throat> but I never thought they'd stoop so low for a seat at the table. No, we can't let Vision get away with this! <sighs> Nicole, what do you plan to do now? Uh, I didn't expect this when I took on the commission. Fine, sure. We came into the Dead End Hollow looking for something, and yeah, saving a kid along the way is a good thing, but... Oh, a small, odd job agency can't take on a massive corporation. So, what do you two think? I'll do whatever you say, boss. But, Anby... I didn't expect to agree with Nekomata on this matter. I'm staying. I understand Nicole's thinking, but I can't follow this time. This is my chance. I won't make the same mistake again. Is that so? Going against a corporation? Anby, you really pulled at my heartstrings! Huh? They're the Vision Corporation! They may be big enough to join the Tops Alliance! Just think of the money we could squeeze out of them if we threaten to expose them! Quickly, Billy, Envy, go tell each of these gold nuggets, uh, I mean <laughs> victims, that the cunning hairs are willing to represent them in their lawsuit for <coughs> compensation! I guess greed Don't trumps all, there. huh? Get everyone to sign the authorization forms! Collect them one by one! And Nekomata, I know you're our client, but I have something for you to do too! Uh, me? You want to save everyone, right? You know the area, and you're the most agile. Here, take my bangboo. I want you to take it someplace and get help. And so she thought of this crazy. Okay, that's scheme. everything. Now <coughs> told me they'd stay in the construction area, collecting victim signatures and monitoring Vision's movements. My mission was to find Faith in and get help. After leaving the others, I went back through the Dead End Hollow and came straight to your store. Really, I'm not lying! Nicole and everyone else in the Blast Zone are in grave danger! Please, Faithen! You have to help me save them! We believe you, Nekomata. But as professional proxies, we have to warn you of the risks involved. Right. In saving all the residents, we'll inevitably come to blows with the Vision Corporation. You don't need to tell me that! I made up my mind ever since I left! All I can think about now is getting everyone out of the blast zone! <sighs> okay. If the client has made up her mind, there's nothing more to say. Well then, let's work on a rescue plan. Take a look at this map. The Cunning Hares and the residents are trapped at the Canvas Street Station, which is several kilometers away from the surveillance point where Pearlman's located. But to keep the trapped residents in check, he's transported a number of armed mercenaries pretending to be public security by train. Speaking of which, the train that we delayed earlier is almost at its destination, so there will be even more of them to guard the residents. We're not strong enough to face them head on, but perhaps we can take advantage of holes in the enemy's defense. Yeah? What does that mean? Look, those trapped residents have no ether aptitude, so the mercenaries don't expect anyone coming from behind. With everyone guarding the front, the surveillance point should be relatively unguarded. That makes sense. We can go around behind them through the hollow and catch them off guard. Yeah, good idea! And then? Then, we quickly hijack the train <coughs> at the surveillance point and go through the hollow to the Canvas Street Station. As long as the residents get to the station platform in advance, 
We can have everyone out of the blast zone in minutes. How clever! The train itself has some resistance to corruption, so as long as we get them out of the hollow quickly, they will get affected! Yeah! Hey, Fairy, can you drive the train out of the hollow and into New Eridu as quickly as possible? Affirmative. I have already mapped out the shortest route. No time to waste. Let's get started, then. Nekomata, take this Bangu. Go find Nicole and tell her the plan. Then... Right! Then, it's crunch time! Next commission. Unlock some more stuff. <sighs> it's not a problem. Okay, so so the next time we play this, we're gonna. I guess we're gonna go now and save all those people that's in that area and Nicole. Gotta let her know, her and the team know on the plan. And yeah, it looks like we're gonna be taking on a whole corporation. That should be interesting. But uh, yeah, if you guys like this video here, um, feel free to leave a like. And if you didn't like it, feel free to leave a dislike. Uh, stay chill, guys. And remember, don't fear the Reaper. <laughs>